my name is Bill Galton. I'm one of the few remaining veterans of John Crosby's municipal campaign in 1965. It's hard on me. I've been with him every step of his political career. So that's why I'm here, to honor him. I happen to have the good fortune in my life to know the first premiers of Newfoundland very, very well. Joey Smallwood, Frank Morris, and Brian Peckford. But you put all of them together, they may equal John Crosby. John Crosby defined Canadian politics for the uh, for tens of years, and new, not just Newfoundland, Canadian politics. He and I were friends, and we're in cabinet together. He supported me and my and what I was doing, and I had a lot of opportunity to work with him, and he became a very good friend, he and Jane, over the years. So I'm, I'm honored to be here and to celebrate what has been an extraordinary life and a unique life. There will not be another politician like John Crosby ever in the history of the country. But he is such a strong public record. I mean, one of the things I've been reflecting on, and I'm here with my husband, is uh, he was a champion of LGBTQ rights. Uh, he, ch he changed, he made amendments to the Canada Human Rights Code to make sure that there was no uh, discrimination on, based on sexual orientation in the federal civil service, the military, the RCMP. And it was a move that was so controversial at the time, Even you know, within his own party. Within his own party. It was, it was. And uh, he had to take it to the floor of the House of Commons. You don't forget that, you know, you, when you come to his funeral with your husband. You don't forget that. I have some seal skin with me today because I, I was thinking earlier today that he was a true fighter for the seal industry and a supporter of the seal industry for Newfoundland and Labrador. And uh, I thought about who's going to take that torch next because he was certainly a significant uh, advocate for the industry and promoted it and Newfoundland and Labrador as much as he ever could. So it's certainly the end of a, a significant era and uh, he was certainly a significant contributor to our country and to our province. You know, he was, he was a unique character. He was a tremendous man, uh, brilliant, uh, but also disarming uh, because, you know, he's a reverence. Uh, it kind of showed a, a side in him that, you know, he, sometimes he just didn't give a damn. And, uh, you know, there's, there's something nice about that. He cared deeply for Newfoundland and Labrador, but he also wanted to show that they were as good as the rest of them. And I think that kind of embodied what John is all about. So, you know, a lot of us have a lot of respect for John. And, that doesn't go to just senior politicians, that goes right down to the grassroots of Newfoundland and Labrador.